What's up everybody, Ryan Hickey here. Is it time for the Philadelphia Eagles to bench Carson Wentz? Should they go to Jalen Hurts as their starting quarterback? Comment below, I'd love to hear your thoughts. For me, the answer is yes, but with a caveat. I'd do it just for one game. Bench Wentz for one game, bring Jalen Hurts and make him the starter, and then go back to Wentz down the stretch of the season. Because to me, Wentz is still the quarterback that gives you the best chance at making the playoffs. We'll start with the numbers first because they do Carson Wentz zero favors. Wentz is first in the NFL in interceptions, 14. First in number of times sacked this year, 40 times. 32nd in the NFL in completion percentage. 24th in passing yards per game. And finally, Wentz has the fourth worst quarterback rating in all of the NFL. The numbers absolutely do him no good at all. It's been very ugly so far in Philadelphia. But the numbers don't tell the whole story. Wentz has been bad the entire season. He still makes a lot of good plays in each game that give the Eagles a chance to win. Unfortunately for Wentz though this year, a lot of the mistakes, a lot of the interceptions, the sacks, the fumbles, really unfortunate have been the reason why the Eagles have lost games, not won games. So he's still playing well, it's not all bad in Philadelphia. So just a quick reset to me could really help the Eagles kind of gain some momentum down the stretch and claim this NFC East, which they are currently leading at three, six and one. I know, impossible to think. But here's why I think benching Wentz just for a game would actually do Wentz good and do the Eagles some good. I'm sorry with Wentz's perspective. For me, it would help him out because being on the sideline, being the backup, maybe could give him a new perspective that he hasn't really seen at any point in his career. He's been the starter since day one in Philadelphia. So maybe taking a step back, seeing things from a 30,000 foot view instead of maybe just being ingrained in the offense and the daily grind of preparing day in and day out can see him and allow him to see different things defenses are doing in order to force him to cause some turnovers. And maybe, just maybe, being the backup for a week will allow him to take a deep breath, see what he's doing, and hopefully from there correct those mistakes. It feels at times Carson Wentz is trying too hard for the Eagles to win games. Now they've been banged up. It's not all Wentz's fault, right? The offensive line has been injured. Wide receivers have been injured. Running backs have been injured. And it feels like with Wentz kind of being the only man out there on a consistent week by week basis, he's trying too hard to win games. He's trying to make too many plays, put the team on his back, instead of just taking what the defense gives him. And that's when you see the highlights of some bad interceptions, some bad fumbles. So maybe taking a step back just for a week, allows him to regain his composure, take a deep breath and understand what defense was doing and maybe have some more trust and faith in the team. And from the Eagles perspective, I know Doug Peterson earlier this week said he is not going to bench Carson Wentz. And if he did bench Wentz, it would signal to the rest of the team that they are basically giving up on the rest of the season. For me, if you continue to run Wentz out there on a week by week basis, you risk losing the team. Because think about it, every single week, it's the same thing with Wentz. He makes some great throws and he makes some boneheaded interceptions, boneheaded mistakes that again, end up costing the Eagles more than it ends up helping them. So it's really almost a definition of insanity because if you continue to run Wentz out there without changing the offense, without changing the way he you call games, how is anything going to change? It's a definition of insanity. And that's when you risk losing the team because if they get frustrated that not everyone is held accountable, then you know maybe some Eagles players will get upset and who knows, this season could really spiral out of control and you could end up missing the playoffs in a wide open NFC East. So for me, benching Wentz for one game would do him some good, would do the team some good, then you hope for the Eagles down the stretch these last four or five games here once we'll come back rejuvenated with a new perspective and that'll be the best example and the best reason why the Eagles can regain some of their composure and make the playoffs. So bench wins for a game. I think it'll do everyone some good in Philadelphia and be their best chance for them to get on the right track to make the playoffs. So again, what do you think? Comment below. Is it time to bench Carson Wentz? Should the Eagles start Jalen Hurts?